You ever wonder if I were here? Welcome back to How Hard Could It Be, the show where a friend and I brainstorm our way through DIYs, viral recipes, and basic tasks that we should all know how to do. And today is the ultimate brainstorm because today is 420, y'all! Today, we're getting a little baked while we no bake our way through homemade tiramisu. It's the delicious Italian dessert with liqueur-soaked ladyfingers, coffee, whipped cream, and mascarpone. April 20th, or 420, has become a massive holiday for cannabis aficionados and casual consumers alike. So we'll bake and make a delicious dessert, including whipping cream to perfect peaks, because honestly, how high could I be? I mean, how hard could it be? I'd like to welcome my guest today. She's an artist and Twitch streamer, as well as an excellent friend of mine, Tater Tot! Woo! Woo! So I thought I'd invite my friend Tay and we are gonna get a little high, celebrate, and we're gonna try our hand at making tiramisu. You like tiramisu? I do like it, but I don't know how to make it and I usually make you make everything for me. Yes, I've also never made this, um, but it's like, how hard could it be, really? Uh, but what do you think is in tiramisu? Chocolate. Okay, chocolate's in there, yeah. Chocolate. And? A little bit of booze. Okay, yes, those are in there, but it's not just chocolate and booze. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, I have no idea. <laughs> well, I'm gonna save your ass because I know everything that goes into a tiramisu by heart. It's four large egg yolks, uh, granulated sugar, heavy cream, mascarpone, good espresso, or very strong coffee, rum, or cognac. Today we're using Kahlua and unsweetened cocoa powder for garnish, and about 24 ladyfingers. You can't remember is that? I know it by heart. Now, the first step you're probably wondering, what is it? We're gonna go get high. Okay, I didn't know where to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh, it hurts. My throat. Feeling anything yet? Oh no, yeah. Not really. You should probably take a batter in. Okay. I want a charcuterie board. Can we do that high? <laughs> so as soon as you're done with the water, I'll, I'll do the first step. <clears throat> oh. So, oh fuck. <laughs> you kept going, keep hitting it. So you're probably wondering what the actual first step is, okay? And first, we have to use an electric mixer and beat the eggs in a medium bowl. Looks <laughs> very medium. So I have eggs in my egg shelf and I'm gonna go get them. This is my egg shelf. Wait, this what's is, in there? This is my mascarpone shelf. Oh. And this is my cream shelf. What is, how do you say it? Mascarpone? 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 Mascarpone. Isn't that how you say it? <laughs> I have no idea. Mascarpone. What exactly is it? It's like a cheesy, like. Is it sweet cheese? Kind of, it's like a cream. Oh, do you want to see it? Yeah. Like, I've always heard of it. It's like, oh yeah, this is in this dish. And I'm like, what is it? Delicious, creamy, spreadable Ooh. cheese for bagels, toast, and tiramisu. I want whatever is on like the lid of this. It's toast with mascarpone and berry, like some sort of compote. You mean, oh, wow, big words. Jam. I would say jam. <laughs> it's more of like a mar marmalade. Ew, I don't marmalade like marmalade. Marmalade is actually jam just but with citrus fruits. Are you purposely saying marmalade? Yeah, lady marmalade. <laughs> <laughs> right? It's marmalade. Have you always <laughs> called it marmalade? I can't tell if you're joking. Marmalade. <laughs> What's marmalade? Like, am I saying it wrong? Isn't there an E at the end of marmalade? Crack it egg, bitch. <laughs> marmalade. You might be like, why would you do this? <laughs> What do you mean, why would you do this? Like get high and make a tiramisu. I mean, I get high and cook all the time, but I, just, I never bake. I have goopies. <laughs> egg goopies on me. Where did I go? No one knows. So I got the eggs. We're gonna whip some eggs. Are you ready? Yeah, go for it. Um, oh, egg yolks. Fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna use my fingers. Did you wash your hands? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. You can 
do this. It's fine. You just go like this. Dude, you're getting it everywhere. Now you're just gonna go, stop, wash your hands. You're just dripping yolk inside of it. Lens. I need you to get a quarter cup of sugar. The sugar is- Where's the quarter? That's it. Sugar's in there. Sugar's in there. Damn, all right. <laughs> quarter cup and put it in there. And I'm gonna wash my hands. Why is it like this? That was so confusing. Oh. She said a quarter cup, right? She's not here to tell me yes or no. So it won't hurt if there's too much. She said it's in the yolk. That's right. What the hell? It's not opening. Ugh. You know what? Why is it in this container? Oh my gosh. It's fine. Shh, everyone, don't talk about it. So the first step is we're gonna use this electric mixer and we're gonna whip together the egg yolks. Yeah. Until very pale and yellow and tripled in size. What are you making with it? I wasn't listening. It's gonna be part of the filling. Pale and yellow, tripled in size. And then the batter should fall as like a ribbon. Do you like it? <laughs> Guess not. <laughs> See, it'd be fine with cream cheese, but this is fucking gross. Paled and tripled in size. It's pale and yellow, and it's probably tripled in size. I don't know if it's tripled. What does tiramisu look like? <laughs> I forget. I just ate it, too. <laughs> Ooh, it's getting there, yeah. Is there, a, is there any possibility of it, of doing it too long? Doing what? Of like doing this for too long? Is there a possibility? Yeah, you can whip them like too much and then they get like curdly, I think. Oh God, I think it's good then. Lens, what are you doing? I had to get some of the... <laughs> you just got it all on the table. Step two. What is it? <laughs> we gotta get, we gotta whip some cream. <gasps> I'm not doing it, you're doing this one. What? Whipped cream and remaining quarter cup. So I need you to get another... Oh. You put all the sugar in there, huh? No, I didn't. It's right here. No, a half a cup of sugar in there. I put a fourth. You put a quarter cup? Yeah. Great, I need another quarter cup. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Oh yeah, you can see how hard this is. What? This is messed up. I can't believe you did this to me. No, 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 no. You're gonna scoop it out. <laughs> that was fucking mayhem earlier. Okay. You do it. <laughs> <laughs> I need you to <clears throat> put that in the bowl. What, put what? The fourth? A quarter cup of sugar. I just told you to scoop it. <laughs> oh, you want to pour some cream? I'm going to kick your ass. Uh, three quarters of a cup of heavy cream. <sighs> Look at this. How am I supposed to get... <laughs> what is wrong with you? What do you mean what's wrong with me? If you're the... <laughs> God, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Dude. That's, I thought it was just. She said. <laughs> I almost went like that, like that was gonna do anything. Why are you putting it in there now? You made all gross. Because I needed it. I just needed another one, but instead I poured an empty. Why do you think I used all of the sugar? No, I thought that I told you to get half a cup and that you put the whole half cup, but I didn't. I told you a quarter cup. Or did I? You'll have to rewatch that part. I don't even remember. She said a quarter cup, right? She's not here to tell me yes or no. I need you to get the mascarpone. That stuff doesn't taste that good. How long does this take? I'm being ignored. Why do we use so many bowls? Because <laughs> there's no oven. Yeah, but why don't we just whip this in the big one? You better hurry up. God. Continue to whip until it creates a soft, spreadable mixture. I mean, I'm gonna, oh. I know that from scratch. Continue to whip until it makes a soft, spreadable texture. Why are you second. screaming in my ears? <laughs> Did you do this right? Continue to whip until it's soft, medium peaks. Oh, not texture?
Oh, it smells good. Are those air bubbles or clumps? I don't know. Bubs? Let me see. It looks like bubbles. Is that right? Magic. Do you love aviators but hate how they always get tangled in your hair? It's always been my problem with standard aviators and I can't wear them even though I know it looks so cool. Shady Rays has these super cute new tangle-free aviators and seriously, they're pretty amazing. You can get the classic aviator look without the messy hair because of their custom patent pending nose piece that they designed specifically to avoid tangling. These frames are lightweight and feel very high-end, as premium as any pair that would normally break the bank. Plus, Shady Rays offers the most insane protection in all of eyewear. Every pair of sunglasses is backed by lost and broken replacements. Lose or break your pair, even on day one, they will send you a brand new pair, no questions asked. All protection program details can be found at ShadyRays.com. Exclusively for my viewers, Shady Rays is giving out their best deal of the season. Head to ShadyRays.com slash tanglefree with code how hard for 30% off their best best-selling tangle-free aviator and much more. Save before they sell out and try yourself the shades rated five stars by over 250,000 people. So now we're adding the mascarpone. Um, we basically want to gently fold the mascarpone into the sweeten. Oh, oh wait, yeah, continue up until. I feel like a child that just walked into his parents' bedroom being like, I threw up, waiting for you to respond. <laughs> we, we're gonna add the mascarpone to the uh, whipped cream. What do we do with this? We're gonna, once we get this to where we want it, then we're gonna add this into that. Don't play with your food. Do what I want. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're whipping until we get to a soft, medium, spreadable mixture. Lynn, do you want to get matching tattoos? We have matching tattoos. No, no, no. I mean new matching tattoos. Oh, yes, I do. Okay, but this is, this is the thing. I want to get dude on my back, and you need to get sweet. Can we do that? Well, what will mine say? <laughs> sweet. <laughs> what will yours say? Dude. Oh, I got it. All right, we're almost there. We're almost there. Okay. Gently fold the mascarpone. <laughs> We're gonna gently fold in. <laughs> Firmly <the> grasp it. <laughs> you have to fold it in. Come on, it's a Shit's Creek joke. Nobody gets that one. I don't. Right. I've never watched it. We'll talk about this later. <laughs> gently <laughs> fold it in. Gently. Are you sure it's like uh, all the way? Yeah, gently fold it in. All right. I don't need the sass. <laughs> Do you know how to fold it? No, I don't bake, dude. Don't you just like flip it, essentially? Yeah. You fold it in. I'm gonna try this part. You already tried it. We both tried it. Not with the cheese in it. Tastes like a tastes like a balloon. <laughs> what? Oh. Now it doesn't taste bad to me. I should dissolve this in a little bit of water. Yeah, probably. I thought you were just kind of keyed. Can you use, bleh, bleh. I can't talk. Can you use those as toppings, like on tiramisu, or is that just yeah. gonna be way too concentrated? I thought you're gonna you're gonna dissolve it. I know. I changed my mind. Keep folding it in. You we're winging it a little bit. Feel like my arm is really far out. I'm like, Ugh. it's just. Is this normal? Do I look normal right now? Yeah. <laughs> you're not even looking at me. You're just looking at me stir. Oh yeah, you look normal. <laughs> Don't let me forget to take my eggs home. <laughs> <Don't let me. laughs> <laughs> like a grandma. <laughs> so there's a couple steps that we're gonna do to prepare the dish for assembly. One is I'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of cocoa powder. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna sprinkle sh oh. <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> it was too much. <laughs> yeah, but you could have done it another way. What is happening? No, Linz, that's not how it works. Bro, stop. Don't use that. What do you mean? Do you want me to do it for you? Yeah. How much? Ooh, it smells good, though. Like, I guess, yeah, there you go. Say, be careful. What yeah. do you mean, be careful? You're the one who <laughs> fucked it. What but do you mean, be careful? I'm like, it's so obvious right now. Fucking. <laughs> Can I eat that? Okay. You said, can I eat that? Yeah. 
It's no, it's not sweet. You don't want to eat this. Oh, it's not. No, it's unsweetened. <laughs> <laughs> so the next thing that we're gonna do is we're going to make our soak, which is coffee and Kahlua because um, we're not using rum or cognac. So this is actually part of the recipe that I saw from Claire Saffitz in her book. She has a tiramisu ice box cake and she uses Kahlua instead of uh, rum. And I was like, that's great. It's still liqueur and it's coffee. Do one cup. Cup. Cup of one. Yeah, one pour cup. it all in there. And if it's all of it, then it's all of it. Mm. You're really tipping it back. And then two tablespoons. Tablespoons. Ready? Teaspoon. And like a splash for good luck, probably. Is that gonna go in there? Yeah, that's one, that's two. Wait, I thought you said two. <laughs> Oops. We're going to dip lady fingers in the dipping sauce. <laughs> yeah. And we're gonna layer them in the dish. And then once we have one layer, then we're gonna- she's yelling at me. Okay. Sometimes it's nice to relax with the sound of crinkling. Ready to soak some lady fingers? I guess. So basically you just kind of dip it in there for a second and it doesn't need to be too long because they're really mushy. No, those are, you're gonna squish them. Uh, we'll see about that. Give me that. Why are they so, See, that's good, right? Or do I need to? No, that's plenty. Oh, okay. It's gonna fall apart. Oh! I told you. I didn't know. It felt fine. This is inevitably step six, where you just eat a ladyfinger. All right, ready? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what if we use that fun brush thing? Like for, why does my brain want to say bacon, but it's barbecue? I don't know if it's gonna work, because it's not a sauce, it's like thicker. Maybe it'll work. Hiya. <laughs> You know, it gives it a nice texture. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, I'm amazing. Let's -a go. We're gonna do the second layer. You ready? Yes. We can soak, soak, soak. Now the key here is not perfection. <laughs> Here's what I'm gonna do. <gasps> we should have. No, we shouldn't. I'm dumb. <laughs> what? I don't know. I'm just thinking, and I already forgot what I was thinking of. <laughs> All right. Spread that. Can we decorate this? Like, I'll make it, because it kind of looks like it would be SpongeBob. I'll make a little SpongeBob face on top. <laughs> okay, no SpongeBob. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this move so funny? <laughs> I mean, go for it. <laughs> You're like a kid that eats glue, I swear to God. <laughs> Hi -ya. Oh, <laughs> I pulled the Lindsay. <laughs> You can't say that! <laughs> oh no. Don't oh no me. All right, one more step that we need to do before we stick this baby in the fridge do and try it later. Do you want me to put the later. rest of the sugar on there? Like sprinkle the sugies? No. Whatever, man. Okay, the final step before we uh, put this guy in the fridge and uh, then we get to try it later. Is Aw, oh, the weight. <laughs> we have to, we're gonna shave some chocolate onto it. And I don't know, this is gonna offend a lot of pastry chefs. Why would it offend them? Hello? <laughs> what the hell are you doing? This feels like what you're supposed to do. You didn't get a knife <laughs> or you, were you just like chop it up? I don't have a cheese grater. What? I, I didn't say anything about a cheese grater. I'm just saying you could have gotten like a knife. Oh, that's working. She doesn't fucking listen to me. <laughs> you're doing it so slow. Okay. Most of it's not even going on there. Now you got it. Looking good. That could cut somebody. What could cut somebody? That blade. And there it is. So we'll see it in like four hours. Four? Here we are, we've made it to the end. All of our hard work will come to fruition when we get to taste our tiramisu. Do you think that was difficult? Um, no, you just made a mess. <laughs> So it wasn't hard. You thought it was easy? So you think it would be super easy if you weren't high? I mean, it would definitely be a lot easier if I weren't high, but it's still pretty easy even when high. Okay, here's our tiramisu. I'm excited to cut into it and try it. You're my guest, so I'm gonna let you scoop into it. I don't know how much I should get. Is that a lot? Whoa. Don't say whoa. <laughs> That's a big piece. What if That's you That's not like even it? that big. Why wouldn't I like it? I feel like I already like the little bitties. Oh. Oh, look at that. Wow. Oh, wow. 
<laughs> Yo, it looks like a mess. <laughs> that looks like tiramisu. Is mine really too big? Dang. What the hell? Why didn't you stop me? <laughs> I couldn't. You're unstoppable. Oh, that's true. Wait. You ready? Yeah. Fresh flavors. Kahlua. I got a big bite of alcohol. So do you like it though overall? I mean, yeah, but you know, I think uh, you just soak them too long. <laughs> Yours is the one that fell apart. I'm gonna try a different corner. Do you wanna have some of this one? Nope. <laughs> well, it's because you <laughs> took like, you know what? Good for you. Let's yeah. try it. A uh, better? Yep. Fine. <gasps> Look at that. Oh, because it's not all soggy. Oh, yeah. Thanks for coming on. <laughs> <laughs> Tell the people where they can find you on the internet. You can find me on Twitter and Twitch as Tater Tot. It'll be written somewhere, maybe. I don't know. Ooh. Thanks for watching How Hard Could It Be. Make sure to come back for the next episode in this series and check out some of the other awesome series on the All Good No Worries YouTube channel. We've got Let's Blend, Please Be Nice to Me, and make sure to check out the Always Open podcast. Hey, what's so funny? Don't laugh at me. I mean, stop looking at me. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. Subscribe.